Welcome to The Chef's Kitchen. I'm your host, Maria Valletta, and we are here at the beautiful PBS 39 Studios at the Steel Sacks in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. And joining me is Chef Lee Chismar of Bolit Restaurant and Inn, which is located right here in Bethlehem, right, Chef? Uh, yes, it is, Maria. We're actually right down the road. So what are you going to make for us today? We have a mushroom soup um, and a Liberty Gardens greens, uh, with, which is also mushrooms. Uh, we garnish with mushrooms there. And I think one of the things that I really wanted to showcase is how great some of the local ingredients in Bethlehem are. Uh, and right now, in the winter months, it's a little tough. So really, the, the things that we're, we're getting that are fantastic are the Ole Valley mushrooms, uh, Liberty Gardens greens, um, and we have some wonderful beets working uh, farm eggs. One of the things that we do is we actually utilize uh, the back slice. A lot of times you'll see chefs rocking forward. Um, one of the things we like to do, if you have a really sharp knife when we julienne, is we actually draw it back. Um, and this allows the knife um, to do the work for you. And you're slicing hmm. rather than tearing. But um, do you need a different, a, se a special knife for that? Um, a sharp knife okay. is pretty much all you'll need. <laughs> um, and that really gives you that um, it wow. actually doesn't tear the cells, so if you're cutting an onion, a lot of times you'll cut an onion with a back slice and your eyes won't water because it's not releasing a lot of the gas from the onion itself. That in turn also allows you to have a little bit more delicate flavor in your soup. This is the royal trumpet. Typically you can feel here it's a little bit more tender. Down as you get to the roots, uh, it can be a little bit more woody. Yeah, right um, here too, yes. especially at the very bottom. So usually what we'll do is we'll actually just take that stem part off. We'll just break these into sixes or quarter them. Nice even slices. We use mushrooms in almost every dish. Do you um, really? And there are so many varieties. Um, typically we usually only run about eight appetizers and usually six to seven entrees. So it is a very small menu and that just helps us keep everything super fresh uh, and really, you know, we just rely on what's local. This is a sourdough toast ring. Um, and I'm just going to toast that out. That's going to go into our soup bowl to hold up our egg. These eggs, we actually poach in uh, boiling water for five minutes and 20 seconds, and then we shock them in ice. Um, so the yolk is still running. We then peel them so you have a really nice egg. So here we'll flour egg wash breadcrumb. Okay. Um, and then we'll deep fry those just before we're ready to serve. Usually takes about less than a minute. So we're just going to top our egg. Right there. Look at that, because he sits right in the little hole of the donut, huh? Yeah. At the restaurant, we actually pour our soup table side. That also helps us keep the soup really hot. Mm. Oh, that Let's is see wonderful. How we did. Will you do the honors of cutting the egg? I like grab a quick bite of salad. That's really one of the nice things. Um, you know, you have the runny egg yolk that just adds a really a nice shot of richness to your soup. Thank you so much, Maria. Thank it was you. It's a pleasure. Thank you.